my children uh, deal with mental illness and I have a son who uh, especially deals with high anxiety and depression and uh, suicidal ideation and uh, there was one day when he was having trouble at school and when he gets behind his anxiety just kicks in and he doesn't even want to go and he just can't get him to go and me being who I am I'm like you gotta get up you gotta go right and I kept trying to encourage him to get up and go finally he did and he left in a huff and uh, two hours later his mother and I get a text saying uh, I made a terrible mistake I'm actually here at home again and I didn't go to school and I'm like what? we just saw you leave what happened so he and his, his mother and I went down to, to see him and uh, he was very emotional and he came up and just gave us his mother a big hug and just said how much he loved us and then shared with us this experience that he had uh, he had went right past the school went onto the, the bike trail down to um, the canyon and there's a, there, there's a bridge there and he just sat on the, the railing there. Very dark place and just thinking about ending his life and, and other things and he sat there for quite a while. There's a lot of people passing him by. There was this old woman who came and just looked at him and just said, how are you? How are you doing? And he just said, I'm fine. <laughs> He's like, no, how are you, really? And it was a miracle, but he started to open up, and he never opens up. And, uh, and talking to this woman about how he was doing and how he was having challenges at school and challenges with mental illness. And this woman got him down, walked with him for a while, got him something to eat, and then drove him home. I said, now you go easy on yourself. And uh, he's, he said afterwards, he's like, you know, sometimes angels are actually angels, but more often they're people with inspiration to do something. Now, I don't know what might have happened, you know, to my son, but I am so grateful to this woman who, through the inspiration of God, I know reached out to my son. He knew that God knew him through that experience and that he was aware of him and that he loved him.